Uh, last game of the week, we have Cleveland. Monday Night Football, Cleveland. Bovada has it minus three at the Jets. Come on, Jets, baby. <laughs> you taking the Jets? Yeah. It's another one, man. I don't like this week at all for betting. It's a tough one. It's, tough it's one. so tough. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to be hopeful for the Jets. Uh, man, I... It, Nah, man, let's go Cleveland. <laughs> it's tough. My computers like the Jets. Uh, my computers like the Jets, um, but I think they're still learning. Yeah. I, I, I actually have this as a push. I wrote uh, Cleveland twenty, yeah. Jets seventeen. It's, it's not one I want to bet on. I feel like this is the game, especially if Cleveland wants to be in a playoff hunt. Man, this is this the, is game. the they game they have they to win. This one. They have too hard of a schedule coming up. Um, look, Baltimore. We saw what Baltimore did to Miami. Those aren't those aren't going to be easy games. Pittsburgh's not going to be easy, and we know Cincinnati's better than what yep. than, uh, than the, these aren't. This isn't an easy division. They don't have they don't have many oh. gimme games. They should win this one. My only hesitation they need that, to win this one. They do. They need to absolutely. If they lose they this one, their their season's over, in my opinion. Yeah, they're in I trouble. know it's only two games in. Zero and two though against you know two two teams that. They would have before the season chalked up as W's Tennessee. Right, right. Now we didn't, but you know no. the, the the Cleveland Browns, um, you know, um, fan club. I'm sure chalked up two W's to start the season. They're, they need to win this game, absolutely. Um, Cleveland, though, a couple things though. You watch that game. You see how how undisciplined they were yes, to start that game, man. They're S- nothing, dude. They're nothing. Six or seven personal fouls. The guy, the offensive lineman, gets kicked out of the game. The left tackle kicks a guy in the head. Of they course. didn't. Third and ones, they have, I think, maybe one of the most talented uh, guys in the NFL uh, in Nick Chubb. They didn't run the ball. Uh, they just you know, completely abandoned the run, and they, they wanted to be the uh, Baker Mayfield show. Look, I like sure. Baker Mayfield. No disrespect to Cleveland and the offense. They have all the weapons in the world, but you got to call a better game than that, man. That game's yeah, on Freddie right. Kitchens, too. Um, you got to call better. You got to use, you got to use Chubb, man. He's so good. He's yeah. so good. What are you going yeah. away from him for? The interesting thing, though, is Greg Williams, the defensive coordinator for the Jets, bro. He knows this Cleveland personnel pretty well. Haven't spent a year there, man. He knows these players. That's those kinds of things make me uneasy. Like when, the, not so much with Miami having familiarity with Tom Brady and that offensive system. I don't care about that. Greg Williams having familiarity with you know Baker Mayfield's weak points. You know, they can dial yeah, up some right. blitzes. Yeah. I think oh, yeah. the Jets are going to get some turnovers. It's not going to be an easy one, man. No, it's not gonna be I know easy. it's not. I don't think it is at all. I know, man. I don't and think it is at all. Now, the Jets, the, their offense looked bad, but Le'Veon Bell played 100% of the snaps, which actually I think is a good thing. Um, yeah. You know, he's going to be involved. Uh, you know, Burley Darnold had opportunities in Buffalo, same way as Cam Newton had opportunities uh, against the Rams. And Darnold missed some receivers, man. He had uh, Anderson open, I think, once or definitely once, maybe twice, for deep touchdown passes, overthrew him. Um, yeah, it's not going to be an easy one. I'm. I, it, it, this is a push to me. I'm not betting on it. If I have to make a pick, I'm going to go with my computers and take the Jets. I don't love it. I don't love it. Um, I don't I don't know. Cleveland has to win. It's, for, it's, it's a must win for Cleveland. So, you know, my Dude, gut, if you're taking the Jets. I'm going to take the Jets. My computers really take am. the my, my, my computers take the Jets, bro. I, 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 don't, I don't feel great about it. I don't uh-huh. feel great about it. Um, fantasy point of view, I think you start Baker. I think you start Chubb. I think they will focus on running the ball with Chubb as well they should. Um, Odell Beckham with his $250,000 watch. I think you can put place him in your lineup. I don't really like anybody else, though. And then uh, for the Jets, I don't really see a lot of value outside of Le'Veon Bell. Maybe Jamison Crowder, if you're in a PPR league, I don't think he's going to do as well as he did last week. But they are trying to use him the way that Gase used Jarvis Landry back in the day in Miami. Um, I think he had 13 catches on 14 targets last week, 99 yards. So they were short passes, but they're moving the chains. Um, so Crowder's going to be a factor. I don't really like anybody else there. So there's a full week, man. Brad, who are your games that you want to watch? Who, what are, what's going to be on your TV this weekend? Uh, well, obviously Green Bay. I'm yeah. going to go to my uh, – go watch it with my family. Yeah, me too, man. Uh, Green Bay, Minnesota. Yep. Yeah, yeah. And uh, that's actually a great game. I like uh, – I'm taking a peruse right now. The Rams Saints is a great matchup. Yeah, man. And, yeah. Uh, <laughs> and I'll be honest, man. I want to watch Cleveland again. Yeah. I, oh, yeah. Monday Night Football. That's right. Good I just want to watch them again for sure. I would like to see. Um, uh, yeah. Let me take that back, man. I would like to see how the Chargers play in uh, Detroit. To be honest. Yeah. The Rams, I, I don't know. I, I, Ram Saints. I'm. I'm really curious about. Um, looking through my Oakland list here KC. too. 
Oakland's uh, Oakland's an interesting one. It's just because I always like watching Kansas City. I always like watching the offense. Me too. I want to see too. what I want to see what that Washington Dallas game's all about. Um, and then also Seattle Pittsburgh. That one's a really interesting. Yes, one right, right. Great so a lot up. another another great week of games. Um, a lot harder to bet for us this week. Um, yeah, real difficult than was man. last week. I did not week, have but... great feelings about any of them. Yep, but we'll get but there. To man. be honest, the, the only one I really liked was Miami, and that's. <laughs> That's not a good sign. No, it's not a good sign. It's not. It's a not. Good side. Do not bet that game. Do not put money yeah, on that that's one. Yeah, that's not good. Don't listen to me, everyone out there. there you ever. Go. No, 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 no. Never. You're going to pick Miami against Bill Belichick and Tom Brady. I know. Say it out I loud. Know. Don't do it. Don't put your money know. on it, I man. I don't, care how, I don't care if the line was 50. Don't do it. Okay, if it was 50, I'd take Miami and just, you know. If it was 50. If it was if it was. What, what would it take for me? What would it take for me to take Miami? What would it take for you? 26 points? I still wouldn't. I still wouldn't. Mm, it would no have way. to be. It would have to be over thirty, maybe oh, over yeah? forty. Seriously, I just the Miami looked that bad to me. Um, All right, but they're not going to be that bad every week. You're right. You're right. You're right. And they did get a butt kicking, so hopefully, you know, they'll have they'll play with a lot more pride. They're correct, at home, correct. so we'll see. All right, man. So I think we can wrap it up. We'll be back with the Pick Six podcast uh, later in the week, so be sure to check that out. Hopefully, we actually make six picks this time. Brad's going to have a little luck. teaser. A teaser special. Brad's going to pick his favorite teaser of the week. I'm going to go through and pick my daily fantasy sleepers just like I did last week. Um, for now, everybody, thanks for uh, thanks for listening in. Go out. Get paid.